Hello students, welcome back to part 2 of oral pathology question paper discussion. Myself Dr. Elizabeth Sojin. So here today we are going to discuss about the 12 must know short essays which you have to learn before the university exam. Okay, so if you have not watched part 1 of this particular video in which I am discussing about the 10 important long essays, do go back and see the first lecture part 1 which uh, in which i have given detail about which are the 10 important long essays and this part 2 will be dealing about the 12 important short essays you must learn thoroughly before the university exam of oral pathology okay so let's start so let's begin the 12 important short essays you must know before going for university exam of oral pathology okay guys so short essays whichever i have already discussed in among long essays i am not repeating those questions in short essays okay so you must be thorough with all the questions i have mentioned in long essay part one of this video short essays are the questions excluding the ones i have discussed already in part one okay so which are the other 12 important short essays the first one being dendigerous cyst okay the first one the important short essay is dendigerous cyst so in this dendigerous cyst particular question if it is being asked to you you should be thorough about the different types of dendigerous cyst the radiological types of dendigerous cyst what is the definition of dendigerous cyst okay and you must also write the pathology histopathology as well as the histological diagram a neat label diagram of dendigerous cyst must be drawn okay clearly and all the important features histological features must be clearly mentioned okay clear now coming on to the second question mucosid mucosil or mucus retention cyst and mucus extravasation cyst these two are very very important so mucosil it's very very important question third question is dentine dysplasia dentine dysplasia so if you look into the chapter of developmental disturbances uh, along with amelogenesis imperfecta dendogenesis imperfecta another important question you must learn is dentine dysplasia dentine dysplasia is usually asked among short essay questions uh, and rather than amelogenesis imperfecta and dendrogenesis imperfecta both of them are al asked along with long essays okay that i have already discussed in part one now the fourth important question is adenomatoid odontogenic tumor if you look into the odontogenic tumor chapter and one important question is adenomatoid odontogenic tumor another important question from the same chapter is calcifying epithelial odontogenic tumor or they can just give you in the question paper as pin box tumor okay pin box tumor so that is another term for ceot both are the same so if anything is asked ceot or pin box tumor you have to write the same answer ceot okay now the sixth important question is verrucous carcinoma very important a neat label diagram of verrucous carcinoma is very very important you should also give uh, important histological features you should mention okay and the pathology very very important now the seventh important question is hodgkin's lymphoma if you look into the diseases of blood chapter okay hodgkin's lymphoma the tumor chapter the hodgkin's lymphoma is given you should be thorough with hodgkin's lymphoma as well as non-hodgkin's lymphoma also the eighth important question is jogren syndrome okay jogren syndrome the radiological features of jogren syndrome is very very important what is the clinical features of jogren syndrome very very important all those things should be clearly mentioned the ninth important question is oral manifestation of aids okay oral manifestation of aids so aids as you know it's a acute immunodeficiency syndrome so as dentist we must be thorough about the oral manifestation what are the clinical features orally which you can see in the aids patient so that question is very very important the 10th important question that too very very uh, current scenario level it's very very important the white fungus or candidiasis okay very very important question so nowadays in newspapers as well as in tv channels they discuss about white fungus okay so the same thing is candidiasis so you must be thorough about candidiasis it's a very very important question if you look into the fung uh, fungal lesion chapter you can see 
bacterial viral and fungal chapter candidiasis is very very important the different types of candidiasis is very important the clinical features uh, and as well as the laboratory investigations for finding out candidiasis is also very very important the 11th important question is pages disease okay if you look into the diseases of bone chapter pages disease is a very important short essay question okay pages disease and the last important question you must be thorough as iron deficiency anemia if you look into the blood chapter uh, you can see sickle cell anemia pernicious anemia iron deficiency anemia all these three are very very important so uh, they can even ask you as long as a along with long as a also they can ask you otherwise they can ask you in short as a okay so uh, you should be thorough with all these 12 important short uh, short, uh, short disease which before going for exam at least one hour before you must go thoroughly through these questions okay so to revise it will be very easy if you note down these important questions okay clear if you want to learn more in detail and if you want to learn in a very simplified manner with so many mnemonics and pick mnemonics and make all the subjects dental subjects very easy just install the app of e dental formula that is dental formula app which is easily available in play store okay so you can download dental formula app in that dental formula app you can easily find oral pathology and oral histology course it is just for rupees 1500 it is easily available for one year so if you purchase that course you can get all the lectures concerned with oral pathology as well as oral histology because both the subjects are very much in connection to each other so both the subjects are given to you as a package for under rupees 1500 okay so if you install the app you can easily purchase that course for one entire year 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 it will be available to you okay so one year it will be available to you for just rupees 1500 okay it will cover all the important points important questions okay about oral pathology and oral histology okay you can also subscribe to e dental formula youtube channel it is e so many lectures are given as free lectures in in the youtube channel okay so please subscribe to e dental formula youtube channel the link will be given in the description box about the youtube channel as well as about the app so both the links will be available in the description box so as you can see in the within the app you can see all the lectures the perio lectures endo lectures pedo lectures community lectures all the difficult subjects all the subjects starting from the basic science to the clinical sciences are easily given within the app okay and you can also subscribe to the channel for more free videos okay thank you guys thanks a lot subscribe to the channel for more such videos